<laughs> I need a freaking Corvette. I like, I'm a crack, I'm a crack addict. But like, not crack, caffeine. But not even caffeine because I don't drink it all the time. Yeah. But if I, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Does that make sense? I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty, pretty low energy right now. Prep is kicking my ass, but the good news is, I have my, uh, <laughs> my Captain America socks. <laughs> Don't worry. Anyways, today, oh man, I'm, like, I'm excited for today. So we're gonna go hit back. My friend Megan's in town. Um, we're cleaning up some of the, the stuff for the Create Your Nutrition launch. Like I said, there's a, there's a lot to it. There's a lot of things happening. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna have fun. We're gonna have fun today. We have a lot to do, uh, a lot to explore. I do wanna explore a little bit. Um, I'm still trying to wake up. 400 carbs as well. So you're gonna see what I'm eating. Let's just have fun. I have 80 days, 81 days until I step on stage. I'm feeling amazing. I'm looking amazing. I'm 193.4. I'm just smashing on every front. Bodyweight to bodybuilding, welcome. Let's get this started. Okay, first step is always, always, always the greens, juice, and yeah, creatine HCL. So clearly, I have a lot of food in this in this refrigerator, but I'm gonna go work out, need to get a back day in, full back day, big back day. So I am, when I get back, going to, I don't know what yak is, yak, but uh, I'm gonna make that. But for now, for now, we're going to have, here we go. bison, asparagus, and potatoes. This is for my con meals, hate on me, I don't care. And then, I'm gonna have maybe a carrot or two. Remember, high carb, I wanna get into the gym, feel good, feel blessed, and smash my workout. So generally, before my workouts, um, when I have a high carb day, so today, for instance, 400 carbs, before my workout, I'm gonna have about 50 to 60 carbs, um, a little bit of protein, like six ounces of a meat, not too much. And then I'm also going to want like a little bit of fats. Remember fats are like key. They're key in your hormones and how you're feeling. They, they have a huge, huge effect. So don't just wait until the end of the day to have all your fats. I've done that several times, made the mistake. Felt like as shit. But uh, look at this shit, man. I mean, look at, look at that. Oh my God, look at that. I mean, look at this. It's all good. So I guess, Masvidal, Jorge Masvidal wants to fight Connor, non-one-time McGregor. I'm actually curious how that fight would happen. I don't know if you watch MMA. I'm a big MMA, MMA guy. But Jorge Masvidal just killed Ben Askren. Like, like Ben Askren literally died on the canvas. And um, was talking so much shit. I would honestly, Love to see that. I don't know how destroyed Connor would get or Jorge would get. I feel like Connor would kind of manhandle him, but I don't know. let me know in the comment section. Now we work out. Let's go. So I want to casually, <laughs> casually talk about Sean Roden and the whole um, case. I don't want to say the word rape. Oh, I already did. Um, but uh, <laughs> they'll just demonetize me. <laughs> But the truth is, uh, that, that whole case, you know, I trained where Sean trained every single day. I saw him every single day at Gold's Gym in Venice. And from what I know of him, and any interaction I've ever had with him, he's a very quiet, nice guy, right? I mean, from all my friends, the people that do know him, that are very close with him, they, they say that he's the nicest guy ever, like he cares about, about you and, and He's first to, to call and first to, to help. So it's very tricky. 
in this type of a situation um, with everything going on. I mean, clearly it's been going on for like a year. It didn't just happen. The woman that, who was the accuser, she went in and, uh, and, and got like DNA te or tested and stuff like immediately right after it happened. Um, and yeah, basically they're saying that Sean raped this woman. This, this, uh, she's also an IFBB pro. And it's just, man, it's just tricky. So this is what I'll say is, um, everyone is innocent until proven guilty. And the problem is that the, the court system is pretty fucked up in the United States. I'm not gonna lie, like, that's my own opinion on it. I've seen people go away that definitely didn't do it, and it's obvious. I've seen people that got away with things, and everybody knows it, even the court, the judge, every, everyone knows it, and still gave them a lesser sentence or whatever. Like, it's just effed up. So you have no clue what's gonna happen. You really don't. You don't know if Sean really did it or didn't do it. They're gonna bring the evidence. I've heard the story. I saw the saw the case files. Like I heard a lot of these different things, and I don't know. There's a couple things that seem fishy, but at the same time, it seems real. Like you never know. So um, we'll find out. Until next time, on the Be Meyer Show. I've never, really ever, I think one time in. Like six years ago, I had some caffeine and I worked out, or maybe seven years, I can't even remember, it's such, such a long time ago. I'm at Starbucks, I have the double smoked bacon and cheddar bagel croissant, oh, shit looks so good. But no, what I'm gonna do is uh, I'm gonna get a, a coffee, and I've, like, like I said, I've, it's been forever, it's been forever. So, first time drinking caffeine and training, I wanna see how it feels, obviously I'm a little sluggish, but that doesn't matter. I, I've always trained for years and years doing that. But, uh, I'm getting a medium, I'm gonna get a medium coffee, a small coffee. I'm gonna get a small, mm, medium coffee with a uh, uh, sugar free something. All right, here we go. Welcome to Starbucks. What can we get started for you today? Hello, how are you? I'm doing great. How are you? Doing? I'm fantastical. I'm gonna have a, uh, I'm gonna have a, um, a medium regular coffee, vanilla. I'll get some vanilla Willa. And what else for you? That's it, man. Thank All you. Right. Bye, buddy. Okay. I already drank half of this. Literally, feel like I just fucking injected 1,600 milligrams of S2 5RXYZ steroids. Uh, if you don't know, if you're new to bodybuilding, that's one of the. Uh, just never mind. Um, yeah, and uh, I gotta say, I really don't feel a difference. I probably will honestly feel a difference once I start training. I'll, I'll experience some type of freaking abnormal shit that Starbucks uh, addict experience. But yeah, now we can, we can finally get our, I think we can finally get our work on it. Yeah. yeah. All right. You ready? Let's do it. Let's go, like Lion comes on. <laughs> All right, let's go. Not a fan. Nope. Not one bit. Every single movement, I'm like, boom, boom, every rep. Two more. Two more. Uh, one more. Uh, oh. All right. 
Next, next two percent. So this last set, I'm gonna do some bicep headbangers here on the Smith machine. And uh, I'm gonna work for 15, two sets of 15, and then I'll be, be done. I'm gonna do some abs as well. So uh, let's get it. Show you my physique. Feel pretty good. Me not flexing my abs here. Flex. More flex. Boom. Good. Let's go. 80, one day is 80. 80, 80, whatever. Let's fucking keep rolling. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Get, get, uh. <laughs> I need a freaking Corvette. Where's Blaze? Dude, I need to get a, I need a freaking Ferrari. Get you know, you know what I actually, I either want a McLaren, I either want my McLaren, or I want a Ferrari Spider. So, so, I'm gonna motherfucking get one. Probably in a year. After I've developed, I can't tell you, because it's a secret. Um, this is what happens when I'm on caffeine. This is really what happens when I'm on caffeine. One cup of coffee is it? One cup of coffee. Cup. Hey, my goats. One cup of coffee. <laughs> No, for real, I like, I'm a crack, I'm a crack addict, but like not crack, caffeine, but not even caffeine because I don't drink it all the time, yeah. but if I, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Does that make sense? So I don't know if you have ever seen a yak. I have not, but I'm guessing that's what it looks like, and that's why I bought this meat. I don't think that this is generally for sale anywhere in any groceries except for the one that I went to, Natural Grocers, because I told you it's the best. Anyways. Uh, I'm gonna chef this up. I'm also gonna have a little bit of gluten-free oatmeal as well. And a big ass zucchini because swerve on them. This is about 325 grams probably. I love zucchini. Let's eat. So we're gonna look up what a yak 
looks like. Yak. Look at the yak. He's like Iceland or something. Dude. What? That's what, I mean. what, brother? Brother, there's no way. There's no way that's what I'm eating, man. It's the Arctic cow. Why would they ever kill a yak? Look at that. How could you ever kill a yak? Look at that thing. It's like in your house. It's like hanging out. It's like waiting for you to come home. It's like, it's like yo. Yeah, shaggy dog. Shaggy dog. It's a fucking yak right there with a hat. There's no way. All right, I'm, I'm gonna test it out. All right, taste test. Oh, it's fucking tough. It's, uh, damn. That's really, really tough. Honestly, I'm, I'm, honestly, I'm just gonna stick to bison. You know I don't eat beef, so I eat bison. I mean, I made delicious meatballs right here. Yeah, I mean, it's okay. Bison all the way, for sure. All right, Megan's here, and we're gonna pot a cast. Great, you. Are we? We're gonna create. What are we gonna talk about? We're gonna talk about nutrition. We're gonna talk about. <laughs> Sorry. Greens. I'm, I'm just we're rich. Talk about money. I'm just rich and I had to <laughs> grab them. People want your $50. I found this in a gym bag. Whose gym bag? Mine. <laughs> yeah, I found this in just a random. Somebody else's gym bag. But I mean, look at these. You're freaking Samantha. She looks great. How much? Create your greens, can you buy with that? Four. <laughs> uh, one and a half. Ooh, that's a lot of health. That's a lot, that's a lot of, of nutrition health. right there. Let's take a second mm -hmm. and just love on these greens. July 30th, it's coming slow. Are you excited for them? I'm excited. You haven't even tried I haven't them yet. I haven't even tried it, but I'm excited. The ingredients are bomb. And she's a nutrition coach. I'm a so. nutritionist, I can say that. Nutritionist. Nutritionist. And coach. She's nutritionist. A nutritionist. She's a nutritionist. Like a little bit of nutrition. Anyways, all right. You like Denver? I love Denver. It's gorgeous. Mm, we burn it all around. You're gorgeous. Oh, stop! I'm gonna make you blush. Dude, don't make that. Stop. <laughs> all right. Weirdo. Let's get it. Okay. I had actually yak today. You ate the yak. Yeah, I ate oh, the yak. How was it? It was freaking yak. Did it taste like buffalo? Um, it's yeah, it's it's very interesting because it's actually higher in fat. So like, uh, like if you have eight, uh, let's say, let's say six ounces, no, eight ounces of meat, you're getting about mm, twelve grams of fat. Okay. And then you're getting like forty eight grams of protein. Mm -hmm. So it's actually like it's pretty caloric. Yeah. I'm not gonna it's lie. Dense. That's a yeah, dense. Yeah, that's a dense. That's one big hairy and monster. And also, um, you want to watch out if you have a lot of sugar in your diet and a lot of fat, that can be a precursor to insulin sensitivity and diabetes. Mm, okay. So that's lo obviously long term. Long term, yeah. So, so yeah. fats are something to watch out for, but they're also really, really important to have in your diet. Right, and so what are some good fat sources that you would say in the fat aisle? So I don't have like, hey, we, we, fat are, aisle. we are the fat aisle. <laughs> Welcome to the fat aisle. Nobody would go down. Nobody would be like, go I don't, down no, I want, yeah. nothing, I want no fat. I'm all yourself at home. Um, really? Yeah. So if you get like fresh raspberries, you can make like a raspberry chia jelly super easily. Chia seeds are very binding, and they give that like gelatinous oh, effect. And that is so good because you can control what goes into it. So you don't have to do pounds of cane sugar, um, and it tastes. You just put pounds of Nutella. It's so much easier. <laughs> That, that's amazing. Okay, so fats. We're, we got fats knocked out. Yeah. Totally. Now it's really, it's really great. Definitely check it out. Thanks for tuning in for another episode of the Create You Experience. And I'll see you. We will see you. Man, maybe. I'll see you next time. Peace. <laughs>
Exactly. I'm the croc hunter. <laughs> All right, so we just heard uh, some news. Someone jumped off of a parking garage over here last week. That was uh, not so great to hear about. Shit. Um, I'm gonna actually put this out there. If you have any, any mental, like, like any thoughts, any suicidal thoughts, anything, like, call the hotline. What is it? What is it? What is it? One eight hundred. Uh. 1-800, yeah, I don't know the number off, head, but off the top of my head, but text 741-741. If you text that number, it's a crisis hotline, yeah. and they'll talk to you right away. Yeah, like, yo, don't do it. They said that the, when the guy jumped, he, like, when he fell and he hit the ground or whatever, he was, like, crying for help. And then he died after four minutes. Like, you don't want to do that. Don't take the chance. Just don't. You have... You even have me, to be honest. Like, you just send me a DM on Instagram. If you're struggling like that, hit me up. I got you. All right, we are back home after a long, long day, a long walk. Sweet potatoes. So, this is actually pretty mind blowing. I used the air fryer, but when I weighed it before, it was 325, 340 grams. Put it in the air fryer for 25 minutes, and then. It ended up only being 135 grams. Um, sweet potato is great for you. So it's only 28 carbs for a whole potato. I was like, damn, that is like, that is gold. So I'm gonna finish up my macros, a lot of vegetables. I have like 70 or 80 or even 90 <laughs> carbs left. Insane. I'm gonna eat. Finish. I just choked, by the way. I felt like I was choking. And uh, I'm gonna head to bed. It's 8.30. I'm exhausted. He's exhausted. I'm also testing out a stress product that we wanna release with Create Your Nutrition. Everything's launching July 30th, so really, really excited for that. Anyways, thanks for tuning in for another episode. Body weight to bodybuilding. Hopefully you enjoyed, I hope, sorry, you enjoyed the back workout. Have any questions, comment down below. Give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you next time. Peace.